Bella. Welcome to Bella Uncinetto. I am Christina and I'm so glad that you're here with me today. If you're new, welcome in. If you're returning, welcome back. No matter how long you've been here, I always appreciate your time. I have something here that I thought, I mean, it is from Australia, but I thought that I knew who it was from and I was going to open it in another video, like as a Happy Mail video. But I couldn't do that because it's for a very specific thing on my channel. And if you're new here, I'll explain to you what it is in a moment. Um, but if you've been around a while, right? Happy May Advent from Christine. So this is one of my um, Happy Mail Advent gifts for the month of May. Now I have already um, opened the one from my other Happy Mail Advent partner, Antoinette at Hook and Stitch in Island Style, who is the creator of the Happy Mail Advent project. So, uh, Antoinette sent me a big box and it had multiple months in it. I have not opened the other month. I just opened May, but she sent me several months of gifts because she's shipping from Canada. So, um, it is easier for her to batch ship. And that's fine. I just won't open them until it's time to open them. So this one is from Christine and Christine is my other Happy Mail Advent partner. She's my initial Happy Mail Advent partner. And then Antoinette and I agreed to be partners because there was an odd number. So the theme for this year is kits, kits of all kinds. So um, we have sent each other different crafting kits. I've done two and a half of the kits that I've received. Um, but I still have other ones to do, but it's, they're coming along. All right, so let's see what this is. Can't, it's like really strong tape. Oh, okay, what is this? It says, handmade with love. Oh, cool. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Okay. So. Okay. So, this is a solar printing kit. Learn to make botanical prints, expose in sunlight, process in water. Made in Heelsville, I'd be saying that wrong, I'm sorry, Australia. Contains 10 sheets of light sensitive blue printing paper. Cool, cool, cool. I have seen this on Etsy. Um, oh, well, that's not helpful says be mindful to open your kit in a very dimly lit room and make your exposures in full sun so I guess I need to wait to open this until I'm not in a bright room <laughs> um, okay so this is the uh, company from Australia, and this says it's a stencil. It says apply this cute stencil to your natural print, to your nature prints, and check out our range of creative stencils on elementalleaf.com. So this is like a fairy or a pixie, right? Kind of stencil, and then it says that the cellophane bag is made from eucalyptus cellulose. And you can compost it. That's really cool. Do you enjoy creating nourishing experiences? You'll love sharing this. Turn nature into art. Just add plants, sunshine, and water to this kit. Create memories that last a lifetime. Handmade with the intention to nurture one's connection and appreciation of Mother Nature through art whilst honoring our innate creative spark. Elemental Leaf is proud to be eco-conscious. The cellophane bag is made from compostable eucalyptus cello. 
All paper-based materials are from renewable and recycled resources. Stencils are reusable and recyclable. Feel free to inspire others and tag images of your works of art with hashtag elemental belief. Enjoy your journey. Aww. That is awesome. This is going to be a fun, fun experiment. I have seen this, how this works before. Um, I've never done it, but I've seen videos of it. So thank you so much, Christine. Um, this video is a little bit shorter than my previous video. Yes, I was wearing the same outfit. Yes, I recorded it on the same day because I opened that one thinking that I could open it with the other one as I previously explained and I could not um, so I have heard just it's not an aside but it's uh, part of this just not about the specific gift I did hear from Antoinette she did say in one of her lives and in a video uh, as well that she does um, plan to uh, continue the Happy Mail Advent Project for next year. So if you are interested at all, please email her. Get in contact with her. Let her know that you're interested and give her your ideas. So um, this is the third year that we've done this. The first year, it was just little bits and bobs that you might find, um, things that you knew the person might like, or just a card or whatever. But the the... Um, thing that kind of holds it all together is for the holidays um, in December you need to make a handmade item and you can decide you and your partner decide if you want to do 25 days of Advent or if you want to do 12 days of Advent or how you want to do but the final gift needs to be a handmade item it doesn't have to be crocheted if you don't crochet but it could be anything if you're into paper crafting, if you're into painting, if you're into <clears throat> uh, knitting, weaving, whatever. It, it could even be a handmade hank of yarn if you spin yarn, you know. Um, you spin fiber into yarn. Um, but it has to be handmade. So the second year, we decided to do squares. I made crochet squares. My other partner made knitted squares. And we sent them to each other. We sent other things as well, but um, mainly the squares. And then for the Advent, we did 25 days, but we did like scraps of yarn. And then the handmade item. This year, we decided to do kits, crafting kits, so that we may, maybe we find other joys. Or maybe we rediscover joys that we used to do maybe when we were little. Or um, maybe with... Uh, our children or whatever <clears throat> and then you know you you learn a new craft whether you keep up with it or not you still learn something new right so we have that and next year who knows what it could be but if you would like to participate and you can tell Antoinette I can only ship within the continental United States and she will try to partner you with someone in the continental United States uh, it's really up to whatever you're able to do. Uh, so please send her a message and let her know if you'd be interested. Uh, it is so much fun. I enjoy it a lot. Um, but with that, I am done. I will bid you farewell. As always, be well, be safe, and be the change you wish to see in the world, everyone. Ciao, bella.